Hi, I'm Joy McKnight, Technology Editor at The Banker, and I'm here today with CEO of Boldmine, Dagmar Alaka. Um, Boldmine is a smart city startup. Um, so can you tell me a little bit about Boldmine, how you came up with the idea and sort of and the technology around it? Uh, we came from advertising uh, background and data background. Uh, so the three founders uh, married all their, all their skills together. And if you bring an advertising, an outdoor billboard, and you pair it up with IoT and data, you, uh, the result is a smart uh, screen that updates itself in real time. Okay, and can you give us maybe a bit of an example uh, in terms of e-commerce? So, we are uh, used to uh, having real-time information online on the products, price, availability. Uh, we don't have that in real world. So, as we go to the shop, we, we need that human interaction. And it's, this is very still very important to us, but we think that objects or screens can take some of that um, to, to, gi to, to give more consistent service to all customers at all times. Okay, um, and can you give uh, a little bit of an application maybe in the financial services industry how banks could use this technology? Uh, so I see it in two ways. First of all, um, the retail banking. So we, we still, we think there is a new life for uh, branches, uh, and like with all retail, uh, this will focus on experience more than a service and transaction. Uh, whereas the transactional part will actually happen with objects. We see Apple Pay and, and blockchain, and uh, this is, it's a very exciting space where um, a vending machine can also become a cash machine, because if you think of Coca-Cola, they have a problem with collecting the cash uh, that people use to pay for their uh, drinks. And that's not going to change. We will still use cash, but uh, th there are people that need uh, change or cash for their parking, for example, or to tip somebody. So we, we, we're not, we're not going to pay for everything with our apps and uh, credit cards. We will still like to, to give somebody a tip. So a vending machine can, uh, can offer that. So it's a very exciting space with fintech and then uh, banks' presence in the city changing. Okay, and you've been a part of the Level 39 community, startup community. Um, sort of what have been the benefits for you? Oh, it's been absolutely tremendous. Uh, if you look at where we were one and a half year ago when we joined, uh, with one desk and where we are now, we've we now one of the go-to companies when it comes to smart city. And this interview was arranged <laughs> by uh, the fantastic PR uh, team of Level 39. So the the benefits multiply um, both in terms of ecosystem. Uh, the example that I just gave you about vending, smart vending, and blockchain. That's the knowledge I acquired here, working with fintech companies. So when we started as an advertising ad tech uh, company or retail tech company, we didn't see a link with fintech, but the link is clear. We, the one cannot exist with the other. So it's really exciting how on those three floors, we've got a community with experts, innovators, and um, um, financiers that help helped us uh, get where we are. Excellent. Thank you very much for joining Thank us you. today.